Joining us for the KTN Sports News, let's start off with the Unified Martial Arts. The Mombasa Tong Il Modo Open Tournament has received a major morale booster. The president of the World Federation Grand Master Takamistu Hoshiko has given the event a thumbs up ahead of its start this weekend. Officials from around the world who will be part of the tournament have expressed optimism at improved standards from the competition that has already attracted 11 teams. Uh, we hope that the competition is going to be highly competitive due to the fact that we have increased number of players, both foreign and local. And of course, that is what we want as a uh, World Tongimro Federation and uh, a country. The more competitive the tournament is, the better the tournament. We are so grateful that in spite of the challenges due to the COVID uh, threat, we were assured by the Kenyan government through Master uh, Clarence that we are safe. So that's why we push through with these games and that we believe in Master Clarence's uh, report. That's why we are here. In fact, this is my first time out of the eight events. That's why I want to be a witness and want to ensure the dignity of these games is at high, at par, like the Olympics. That's why we are preparing and hoping that we can be part of the Olympic in the future. I never miss, and I see more and more participants' number is growing and technically improving, and I feel great hope that through Tongirimodo uh, development in Mombasa Open Tournament, uh, we can also expand not only Kenya, but also all of Africa. And to save young people especially, we educate young people through not only physical, technical teaching, but also our internal moral teaching. Excellent turnout for the international event. Moving on now, Kenya leads in one of the categories after the five rounds of play of the Africa School's individual chase championships in Nairobi. The mixed results have seen Elizabeth Cassidy Minor leading in the girls' under-11 category with compatriot Wamboy Barnis in second position. Reddy Dea from South Africa is in third. Ghana's Mawuli Richardson is leading the under-13 open category, while Sue J. Jora from South Africa is second and Muti Austin from Kenya is third. South Africa leads again in the under-17 open category through Lefiedi Katego, as Yakolev Saveli and Robert Machielo are third and fourth respectively. Now here is the big question. How will the Africa Cup of Nations affect the English soccer? Well, Liverpool manager Jurgen Klopp has no plans to find transfer window solutions for Africa Cup of Nations absentees. That's Mohamed 